Hello again, everyone. This is Bitterback in a 7 with the uh, 6B. In the last part, we did more levels. More rooms, rather. This one mainly, and this one. <clears throat> and then I spent, like, almost an hour on this stupid room. Only to end up finding out, between takes, that I did it wrong. I need to use one burrito only for the roach. That will kill the first on click, which I'm guessing is this one. So yeah, I did it wrong. Oh, fun. So much fun having to do this room that I love so much over and over again. Alright, All right, so this should be possible somehow. Let's see what I can do. Oh yeah, I can't even use that because of uh, stupidity. Okay, can I line up a kill for this guy actually? It's, I don't remember that well. Nope, I don't think I can. Yep, it's lined up with this guy, so... You have to kill it from... Yeah, yeah, that was the guy I wanted to kill. Right. So yeah, I have to pull this off somehow with only one splice bite of the thing. Guessing maybe I can go through here and then do this and no. What? What am I supposed to do here? No, I'm not particularly feeling that invested in this room anymore. I want it to die. I want this room to be dead. Because it is dumb. I have no particular desire to see this room thrive in the economy. Like, not, not even at all. Yeah, this has to be the first one I kill. There's no going around the issue. If it isn't, then I can't even get to the other roaches after that. Okay, right, I remember. I need to go through here now. Okay, so now, what, what now, then? No, it, it it doesn't even work. Cause the roach is right on my rear end. He's tailgating me as 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 the bunch of other roaches have been saying that they should not do. This is not possible. And I'm too tired, if it is, to see the possibility in it, so I just don't even care, really, to be honest with you here, friend. If that is even your name. Could I even consider you a friend if you're putting me through this? Eh, very debatable, I must say. I must be honest with you. Very debatable, indeed. Okay, I need to get the roach to be a, f a, a tiny bit further away from me. Can you see the joy in my voice as I try to go through this room? It's very non-existent if that's what you're wanting to know.
I mean, I guess I could probably do a thing where I stun the arm flick or whatever, but no. I can't actually, not, not from this angle. No, it doesn't want to be stunned, see? It could work if he wanted to be stunned, but it doesn't. It's too good for that. <laughs> That would save me the turn that I need, I think. I could stash it in there, as if that ever did anything for me. As if it would even do anything. Seriously, what does that do for me? Nothing, if that's what you're asking. Although, I, I am thinking of an idea right now. It's perhaps not the most ideal idea, but... If I can stun this guy, then step here, and then... Maybe I could get it to face... As I go somewhere, maybe? It's one thing that does allow me to do this. With a roach right on my rear end, I can't exactly manipulate this into a very useful situation. And I can't even do the crazy ortho square jumping thing that I'd wanted to do. Go up here. This is a dead end. Just like the hopes of this puzzle being good in my eyes. That's that's for darn sure. Okay, let me try that again. Okay, so I needed more help, but one thing I didn't figure out was that I can just use the arm click over here and boom he's dead now I have five pockets of gas remaining and now I don't even need to use a burrito okay so second arm flick this one will go down the same way that, the, uh, that it did last time I believe yeah that one I shouldn't need yeah I think I, I will need the pocket Did I need one for that one? I don't recall. Anyway, the point is, okay, I can't go to the east yet. So what I want to do is set this up in a way where the roach is going to be over there. Forgot how I managed that the last time. It's really tricky and annoying. I think I recall that much. Oh wait, I think I did that. Yeah, I did that. Okay, so... I'm not sure what that point of that is gonna be. Again, but I can go in here. No, I think I'd like to not do that actually. What I want to do is to get it to the south of me.
Yeah. If I get if I can get it south, then then I can go up here through there. Basically, what I want to do is go here, then lure the roach back into here, then have it, and then I fart into this direction, and then all the things gonna end. Okay, so now I gotta get the roach down here. But from which direction will I manage that? I forget how I managed this one. It's been a while. Shut up. Actually, I recorded a spot a little after the previous one, but yeah, it's still been a long time, so please don't stop judging me, alright? Just you know, with your judging eyes. I don't like it when you do that. And can, I, can, can you do me a favor, man? Please? Thanks? Thank you. Right. Let's get this show on the road. But how? I think this is the only way I can really think of. I can't abuse the Ortho Square some Wait, no, I don't think that'll happen until I get rid of this guy. Yeah, okay, so let's see. Yeah, from down here, I don't think I'll do much good. I could abuse here. Hmm. Did your mother raise you in a sewage farm? Yeah, yeah she did. Clearly. Even even the blurbs on the roaches can't really cheer me up right now. This room is honestly just sapping all my will to keep puzzling on. I'm gonna refer to my previous attempts. Be right back. Well, put on a dunce cap and call me Harold. I am really stupid about this. Let me show how it's really done. I was actually pretty close to what I was supposed to do, but... No, it's not here that I'm supposed to kill the, the elf lake, but over here, actually. There we go, and that takes care of that. Okay, so now I have three blasts remaining, which is optimal for what I have to do next, I guess. Okay, so the roach needs to go to the east of the tree in order for me to be able to get it to kill the Omphalic here. Now, how the heck am I even going to do that? Well, it's almost certainly going to involve something. Oh, wait, I think I actually see a solution. Or do I? I don't know. Do I? Wait, no, I think I might see something. Nope, that's not it. What I want is to get the roach over here. I think that'll be a good place to get started. Really. So, how do I do that? What I can do is, uh... Leave him behind the tree, do what I was doing earlier. And bam, here we go. 
farted over there and let me just save. Just yeah, stop standing there, okay? You're not very attractive. Like, if anything, you're even more repulsive than anything I've ever laid eyes on. Okay, no, this doesn't do what I want it to. It just makes it even worse, actually, in fact. Because that's the opposite of where I want this to be. I mean, it works. For, all, for what it's worth, it seems to quote-unquote work. Not quite a working I wanted. Yeah, now it's still stuck at the east of the tree, which is not what I want. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, is there anywhere I could send the roach otherwise? Hmm. Up here? No, I can't reach that. I could send it that way, but that's actually not good enough. That's proven multiple times before. Yeah, this is the only way that seems to make the logical sense to me, but then what? Like, this is exactly the situation I want to avoid. I want the roach to be to the east of the tree, not to the west of it. Alternatively... Nope. Wait, oh, there we go, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, 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 okay. We have this in the bag, I believe. Ladies and gentlemen, this room is done. Just have to kill this on flick the way I did it before, and we are through. Thank the heavens, this room was really getting on my nerves. So I have both bridges still up, as I'm supposed to. And I can just do that. Bring this jerk over here. He's a, he's a big jerk. Don't worry, I'll fort him out of existence soon enough. So after that... Yeah, I want to take the bridge shortcut. Okay, so I guess this wasn't too bad. Oh, I farted. I guess this wasn't too bad, but... At the same time... Uh, I can't really... I can't really give this room accolades for anything. I can't even say it was really that enjoyable. To feed... I needed the solution to be given to me, and even then, even then. Okay, so there's this room, the final room, the spiral room. I need to open this, which means that I need to toggle these orbs. So let's try to do that. I need to toggle the orb. And let me count the roaches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six toggles to make. Or five. Okay, so I don't need to kill all the roaches, only six of them. For the secret, anyway. Well, that kind of makes things a bit less harsh for me. Which I can appreciate after that previous room. <laughs> That's already two done. Hmm. I have eight burritos, though. 
Yeah, so I, does that means I don't have to use them on all the roaches, on all all of the burritos used on the explosions. So I can also break some walls. I'm gonna try to break them all. See what happens. Oh, and there's that roach free. Because I guess why not. That is a pretty disgusting sounding fart. Tiny but very disgusting. Okay, so breaking on the walls does not seem to be the answer. Or at least it would be if uh, they were actually broken. Kill all the roaches! You know, that's the opposite of what I'm trying to do here. Okay. Trying again. Okay, so I should take note of the walls that aren't broken. Because that's actually kind of an interesting aspect of this. Okay, so... Alright. Alright. Okay, this guy I can actually set him that way. So that's two toggled. I need to toggle four more. Here's one more. I can fart this one away too while I'm at it. I only need to toggle it three more times, which I cannot do now because I wasted everything. how the scripting was done for this. I just can't help it. I get curious. Anyway, this guy. Need to toggle three more times. I have enough roaches left, I think, for that to happen. I'm gonna have to be pretty crazy careful with the way I do this. Just from this point onward, have to be sent in a direction, in a direction. Lest they not even be sent anywhere. Okay, that's definitely not where I want to go. That's two. Need to toggle three more times. Okay. See, what if I made my way towards this guy instead? Well, that's not gonna do much good for me. Neither is this or that. So, send Mr. Flying. Kinda have to flee that way, not much of a choice there. And if you could give me some time to set myself up for disappointment, I'd appreciate it. Let me try to enter from a different place, as if that would change anything. 
Okay. Definitely not going that way first. The fact that I can free this roach is interesting, though. If I kill it, then I can go whichever way I want, I think. Aha! That's interesting. Okay, well, that's just not fair. Okay, four more toggles, which I will not be getting in this position. something interesting going on here or maybe not yeah a man can dream Ugh, seriously these are kind of gross sounds okay so this is another room that seems like it's gonna be a bit of a pain to go through I mean, I pretty much already knew that from the, t the first time I attempted it, but yeah, now it's really showing its true colors. And I, and that, that's not a fart joke. <laughs> At least I don't think it is. I need to fart this roach away. I have multiple gas pockets remaining. But the pit makes it so that if I do this wrongly, then I'll be doing it wrong. Most certainly. If I want, I can destroy the orb. Although, I don't see any point in doing that. Hmm. Hmm. Pondering sounds. Yeah, I, have, I haven't stopped making those since, like, the beginning of everything ever. Nope. It still doesn't work, no matter how many times I try it. That's exactly what I did.
if I could just turn around, have some time to turn around and then just hit this one somehow, that would be great. Seriously, this is really kind of gross. Okay, these are perhaps a bit too realistic sounding. <laughs> Makes me slightly uncomfortable. Slightly. <laughs> Yeah, just keep farting on this road, that's totally gonna do anything. <sighs> yum, yum, yum. I wish I could enjoy this as much as you do, B throw. Break my if I could break walls by bumping into them, that would actually help a lot. Okay, so now I have three roaches left. This room is possible to do with only three roach kills, but I want to actually try to get to that secret room, which is probably gonna be very terrible. Which would be in line with some of those rooms I've seen so far, to be honest. I don't like making that non compliment, but it's honestly kind of true. As much as it pains me to say that, the concept's clever, but some of these rooms are just very crazy and not that fun. I guess I could fart the roach away, if that ever even did anything. I don't think freeing the roach is worth it though, because like all that does is lead to general discontent. You know what, I'm gonna try to kill this guy. Okay, there's one. Need five more, oh boy. It's not be so great. Yeah, this is trial and error, pure and simple.
This is definitely not the way to go. Okay, I know that. I cannot go that way. I also can't really go that way. Well, no, I can. I can. But also then that happens and that's also kind of not too desirable. But then if I go kill that roach, I can go straight for it. But that's also undesirable, so nope. Can't go down there because of that. Can go for that one, but also again, not too recommended. Blast this one and then go down there, which does actually get me two orbs. Then there's this situation. Now if I try to go down over there, same situation happens, I die. Go there, same thing. Now this time the, the other one actually gets in my way, so... There's also this direction I can go in. It seems like northwest and southeast are really the only two directions that actually get me anywhere. Then after that, oh, I don't know. I don't know about anything else, man. Five pockets. Okay, so is that information? Okay, sorry, I was a bit tired there. Not talking. Happens a lot. Hmm. I can only toggle three times. Breaking the walls is certainly not gonna help anyone. Unless it's on this side. That didn't seem like it did much to help with anything at all. Disgusting. Okay, so... Well, how about I just kill it? Now there's these two rows of roaches. That's totally what I needed. Two of something. Let's see what happens if I go destroyed out of the wall. What if I had the roach itself activate the pressure plate? I can't even do that. I don't think I can. I could probably be doing this. And with the roach actually activating the plate, that gives me some time to actually face a good direction. Interesting. That doesn't do me much more good after that. Like, that seems to be a solution, but to all my problems, I don't think so. I can only get one orb before getting truly stuck. We're stumbling upon something here. Right. Um. So she opens up some possibilities, I think. Best one seeming to be this one so far. Stupid <sighs> 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 
Ouches. Can't you be farted better than that? Where are the other roaches I couldn't quite get to because of that one jerk down there? Not this one, that's for sure. Wait. No. The burritos won't help with anything if I don't collect them right off the bat, so... They don't block the roaches. That could have been an interesting puzzle, but no. This is interesting. I only have four pockets though, so now I can't really abuse this anymore. Why is farting so hard? Like seriously, but, but this this is really just tedious, to be honest. Like I, I I was never biggest fan of trial and error. Although I shouldn't really be one to complain considering some of the rooms I've made. Still, just because I've done some terrible stuff doesn't necessarily justify others making it. If it did, then that wouldn't be good. I don't think. If I had a speed potion, that would help. Yum, 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 yum. Who thought a hold about farting could be this annoying? Yeah. Yeah, what I like about these kinds of puzzles is that they're all execution based and it's like, yeah. You just have to figure out the magical sequence. I never really end up liking this kind of stuff where there's just random quasi luck based thing. Although it's all logical, mind you, so there's only a finite number of possibilities you can try out. But then, it's like, you still so many, you don't want to try them all. <sighs> yeah. Let me make this less of a suffering for you, I'll be right back. Okay, alright, so, I experimented a bit off screen, and here's the solution that I actually found. If it wants to work, it should. Okay, so... Now I just have to do this. Set them flying over there. Now for this one, I want to send only one. I can kill the other one, I don't care. So now for the next series of farts is going to be pretty interesting. So send this one careening. Um, 
for that, I... Okay, yeah, so that's pretty much what I wanted to end up with. I just have to now be very interestingly careful. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there we go. Boom! And the Wobba press the thing, and we have a secret. Let's find out what this horrible thing is. Apparently, from what I hear, it's horrible. Anyway. So, let's go up here. Through the path. Un -dun -dun -dun. Oh! Need an, need an astronomic gastronomic delight? Try Burrito Bill's Red Hot Super Burrito. Equivalent to 10 Nito Burritos. If it doesn't keep you chained to the bathroom like a gentry, we'll give you back your money. We'll give you your money back, guaranteed. Refund is not guaranteed. Oh, my Billy. Alright, okay, so what's the point of this? Not hitting the things? Okay. Oh no, don't tell me. I have to make it all the way through this stupid mess. And then I have all these three roaches with me. I'm guessing I don't want that to be hit. Okay, so that's just gonna be fun. So I have to fart the roaches away without destroying any or even doing anything harmful to myself. Okay, so that's that's gonna suck. So this is saying, good to know. Good to know. Yeah, I should probably not be trying this because the video is already long enough, so I'll take this on in the next video. So yeah, this has been Bithrobutkina7, or Bithrobutkina7, however fast you want to pronounce it, it's fine with me. Anyway, join me in the, join me in the next part where we take on this final thing, and then we'll be done with this thing. So yeah, I'll see you in the next, I'll see you in the next part, until then. Learn to enunciate your words, kids, and have a nice one.